Hi everyone, I hope you're well. As you all know, we're in the run up for Christmas. It's only 14 days, 13 days. So obviously I've done a bit of shopping, quite a bit of shopping to be honest. So I thought I'll show you what I picked up at a lot of different stores. There's Ikea, there's H&M, there's bookstores. Um, I went to CNA. Um, an interior design knickknack store called Nanu Nana and well I'll just show you what I got and I tell you where everything is from. We're starting with a bit of kids clothing for Amy and we're diving in with this lovely little mustard coloured skirt. It's 12 euros and I love the colour. It's the same colour as the coat you will have probably seen over on my Instagram or on the blog and I'm just obsessed with it. It's the perfect colour for this season because it just inserts a bit of colour and happiness and I absolutely love it. If I could get away with it I would totally wear this myself but I don't want to do that to anyone. Um, these are just some plain, well not plain, they've got like a little glittery heart print on them. They're just tracksuit bottoms for around the house. Um, and they're from H&M and they were 14 euros 99. And they're really nice and soft and fluffy in there. I don't know what sort of material that is. Let me have a look. Yep, no idea. But it's really nice and fleecy so that's gonna be nice and warm and snuggly after a day out in the snow. I've also picked up this cute little denim dress with a little brown belt and I absolutely love that. Imagine that with some like grey or brown tights and some boots. So cute. And that was $14.99 as well from H&M. Also from H&M was this jumper. Um, that was $9.99. And it's got a star and a print on and it says forget the rules because obviously they're there for breaking or to be broken and that was 9 99 and it's perfect to go with a pair of jeans or some tights and a skirt and lovely another really cute little jumper is this one from CNA it's dark navy blue and it's got rose colour copper stars on it and that was nine euros. Bargain. Um, we also picked up this little dress. There's a hair on there. Um, and it's black with like cream and like pink little polka dots on it. And that we picked up from a shop called Tackle. And it's only $9.99. Amy loved it instantly. And to go with it, we got this little bolero style cardigan. So it's just a short one where it's got long sleeves. And the colour matches the polka dot. So that's going to go together really nicely. And she probably is going to wear that on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day or Boxing Day, anything like that. And then I picked up some bits and bobs from Zara, two pieces. And one of them is this cute little camera shirt, just a normal white long sleeve shirt with the camera on to top or at the front and I love that and I think that was 9 95 so really cool and I think that will go together really well with those li with this little do you call it score yeah scores it's a scored so basically shorts that look like a skirt du -du -du -du. hang on so here, this is really cute 
I like the pattern. I don't know if you can see it. It's like red and black. It's got a little bow. And I think it's perfect for Christmas as well. Pop on some black tights, this and the camera shirt and you're good to go. And that was $21.95. So a bit more expensive, but it's great quality. Amy loves it and so do I, so it's worth it. So that's all the clothes I believe. I also picked up this baby blanket for my friend's little girl. She was just born and it's really nice and cuddly and it's got little little sharks on top. Might look a bit boyish but I think it's really nice and neutral and it's so soft. I love it. So next up Oh, there's so much. Let's go with this. I've picked up this book for some Christmas reading. And it is basically a German version of Charles Dickens' Christmas story. But it's been rewritten for kids. So we're reading that at the moment. And Amy really likes it, so that's a win. And it's really nicely illustrated. There aren't many pictures in there, but like the ones that are really nice. And I just love this story, so I thought it's a must. And then another absolute classic is this book. It's Pippi Longstocking Celebrates Christmas. Obviously it's a German copy, but it's just as fun in English. And we love Pippi in this house. So, We've picked that one up. She's already had that one in kindergarten with her and they read it and they all really liked it. And let's go with Ikea next. Okay, I don't know about you, but I actually only went in there to pick up some candles. In the end, I spent 130 euros on that. Expensive candles. But I got a couple of bits and bobs. First up, I got another kitchen chair, the Iva chair and like a cushion to go on top of it. That's already in my kitchen, but it's just a plain wooden chair and it's only 20 euros. So I picked up another one of those. And then the next thing or the next couple of things are more of a decorative nature. So first up, We've got this print, or actually these three prints, and it's one of London, one of Paris, and one of New York. And I would like to create like a gallery wall behind me. So I also picked up three river frames, which are black to go with them, but obviously I don't have them with me now, otherwise, I don't know, I wouldn't be able Keep an overview on what I've got. This is just a cushion or like a pillow inlay which was I think $1.99. Then I've got a cushion cover, goo clocker. It's grey and it's going to go really nicely with my sofa. Then I've picked up these three cookie jars and they're three they're stacked into each other I don't know if you can see but there's a black one a white one and a smaller black one and I really like them and I think the design is quite classic so I will be able to use them throughout the year and not just for Christmas and Another cushion inlay, um, some colourful gift tags for Christmas, um, a sellotape dispenser, need that for wrapping, um, da -dum -dum -dum. a little blanket or throw for the sofa also grey and it's really nice and soft so I hope the cat doesn't get hold of it. Um, dum 
Another set of gift tags. Some colorful ribbon. And two loads of brine wrapping paper. Because that's basically what I'm going to do this year. Everyone apart from Amy is going to get brine wrapping paper and then some colorful ribbon and gift tags and maybe a couple of bows on there and job done. I hate wrapping papers, uh, wrapping paper or the whole wrapping present. So I'm gonna keep it as easy as possible. And then I've also picked up this yellow cushion. It's more of a mustardy color and I promise it does not look like a dish towel. Although it does on camera, doesn't it? But it's really nice. So that's gonna go with my sofa as well, which is gray if you, in case you were wondering. Don't know if you can see it in the background. Okay, and the other, oh, another load of ribbon. Gotta get something in there for the men, don't we? And then I picked up this candle, it's called Luga. And this is, I believe, cotton. Doesn't really smell for it. They had one open and it smelled really nice. And I believe that's like the cotton or linen or laundry scent. So really fresh, not flowery at all. So yeah, there was another one in there. It's also got Luga. It's also got laundry on, on it. But it's clearly different from that one. So we'll see <laughs> what they smell like. They were nice, they smelled nice and fresh, so I know I will like them. I just can't pinpoint the scent. And the last candle I picked up is the Zinlich Vanilla Candle. It's $2.99, I believe. It smells of vanilla and it's really, really nice and it burns for 40 hours, so you can't go wrong with that. That is all from Ikea. <clears throat> and I've also picked up some bits and bobs in a shop called Nanunana. I love them. They've got like really small, <coughs> excuse me, like some nice little knickknacks and gifts and um, decorations for right in the house. And I've picked up some... Um, what am I talking about? I'm just going to show you. Okay, I've picked up Santa Claus wrapping paper for Amy. So it's like three rolls, they're all the same, but I thought I better get a couple more in case I run out. And she's the only one who gets coloured paper. And that was 95 cents. Um, oh, there's like loads of random stuff in here that I bought at the same time. So yeah, my friend's gonna get this baby set, the one who's also getting the blanket. So it's all nice and grey and neutral. And this set um, came with another 10 euro gift card for the shop I got this from. And it was only 14.95, so. <laughs> So you get all this plus £10. Can't go wrong with that, can you? So I've also picked up some gold and silver bows and ribbon and string. God knows, all this stuff I really do not like. If I honestly had a wish, I would right now wish that I would not have to do the Christmas wrapping. I hate it. Everything looks horrible. I don't know. Or can you imagine working in a shopping centre and wrapping presents all day? I think I'd honestly shoot myself. It's horrible. That must be so frustrating. This one is a game for my sister's boyfriend. And it's called Suspension. And it's a hanging balance game with 24 game rods, frame rods, colored dye, a wooden base, and a wooden connector. And you basically hang your game piece and change the game. So you have to move all the little, like, what are they called? 
game rods without the whole thing collapsing and it's from Melissa and Doug. I thought that looked great fun. I had a little play in the store and I think that's going to be fantastic for Christmas if we get bored. Okay, then I've got more ribbon. This is just like silver, silver with a couple of snowflakes. This is white, then grey gingham with stags and a heart. And this is just, don't know, glittery silver, grey, whatever. And then oh, another silver one. Looking at that, I've gone totally overboard with the whole ribbon, but I guess I can still use that for years and years to come. Um, also for my sister and her boyfriend, I have picked up these two go mugs, one each. They were $14.95 at Nanu Nana. And the pink one is <laughs> actually for her boyfriend, but who cares? And it says, klug war's nicht, aber geil, which means, well, it wasn't clever, but it was fun. And this one's for my sister. And it says, well, yeah, it can be nice, but it doesn't help. <laughs> which is like perfectly her and then I've got in here the gift card for my friend and I also picked up those little owl booties to go along with the present because I mean how cute are they couldn't pass them up could I oh I love babies and then oh yeah these are two gift bags that I picked up at my local supermarket. One with stags and a forest scene. And this one's for my sister. She's obsessed with owls. So she's going to get this wintry, Christmassy owl bag. And I'm going to pop God knows what in there. She's also getting a perfume. <laughs> and a really... Do you know these like sweat bands and arm armbands for sweating? I'm gonna get a personalized one of them in bright neon to go with a present she's getting from my parents. It's just a joke. <laughs> but when I heard what she asked for, I just had to get that. I know it's completely evil. But it's gonna be so funny. And in here, I've got some garland for my Christmas tree another bit of garland which has got stars all over it oh yeah another garland du, 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 du. and <laughs> some hair colour for me because I'm getting grey roots and it's really depressing. I'm only 32. But yeah, I'm gonna just pop that on there and hope for the best. Yeah, everything's falling off the sofa because there's so much of it. But yeah, that's everything. And I hope that was entertaining. What have you bought recently? And what's the present you looking forward to giving to someone else the most? Leave me in the comments below because I'm still after some little bits and bobs. I've got all the main presents, but it's those little fun ones that make it really special, isn't it? So let me know what you got for your loved ones, your friends or your kids. Um, hit subscribe and the like button and I'll see you soon with another video. Bye!